Hi guys, the plan today is to have another go at a potato powered boat. So this is the same setup as was on the solar robot kit. I've stretched it a bit to fit over this larger bottle so that I've got enough buoyancy to carry the weight of the potato. And all I want to do is to see if we can get the propellers to turn in the water. That's important because we've got the additional resistance of the water. So I'll now boil my potato. I'll only boil it for about nine minutes this time. I was boiling it for longer the other day and it was falling apart when I was trying to use it. So we'll give it about nine minutes. Then we'll stick in the copper plate. Now I've got this, it's bright zinc plated, is what they call it. It's, it's just a metal bracket, but the, um, it's BZN, I think they call it, or BZP, bright zinc plated. That's why it's shiny, so it's, it should have zinc plating on it. I don't know how effective that is. But that's what I'm going to use. I was trying to find something bigger than the screws that I was using to give us more surface area. Well, I've boiled my potato. For nine minutes. I'm going to leave it to cool down a bit first before I start playing with it. All right. It's still hot, but I can at least hold it. I want to try and get as much of this plate in there, so I'm going to push it in lengthways. In fact, I think I might push a knife in there first. Okay, that's in there. So that's our battery. Nothing. Ah, oh, frustration. Nothing at all. Oh, it is moving. Movement. Not much, but we had movement. And we've got the balance right. So we're making stepped progress. I've no idea whether that zinc plated plate is good enough. I think I'm going to have to find some proper zinc. Summary, another failure, but on the positive side, the boat supports the weight of that potato easily, so I could put a much bigger potato in there and we'll be fine. 
but it's just teasing me. We get just enough to turn the pulley about a quarter of a turn and then it stops again. So I'm going to have to do a bit of reading, see if there's anything else I can do to improve the um, amount of current we're generating. I suspect that the zinc plated items that I'm using are just not good enough. So I may have to use proper zinc or maybe even carbon and get carbon rods out of old batteries and see if that works.